Hello students. Now we shall solve a problem on the topic arithmetic operations on fuzzy numbers. So here we consider two triangular shape fuzzy numbers A and B defined as follows where A of x is equal to 0 for x lesser than or equal to minus 1 and x greater than 3. x plus 1 divided by 2 for x lying between negative 1 and 1. 3 minus x by 2 for x lying between 1 and 3. Similarly, we have the fuzzy number b of x to be equal to this. Now, the question is, employ the four basic arithmetic operations on fuzzy numbers given above. So, these are the two fuzzy numbers. So, they are asking us to employ the four basic arithmetic operations. What are the four basic arithmetic operations? They are addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. Now, first what we shall do is, we shall see the star operation in general for fuzzy numbers. So, by the definition which we have already seen in our previous video on arithmetic operations on fuzzy numbers, uh, the, uh, by using that, we will uh, pro proceed this problem. Arithmetic operation on fuzzy numbers is defined by its alpha cut, that is, alpha cut of A star B, where this star represents any of the four basic arithmetic operations. So, alpha cut of A star B is equal to alpha cut of A star alpha cut of B. So, this is the um, uh, de definition of star operation for arithme uh, of arithmetic operations on fuzzy numbers. Now we shall employ one by one that is first we shall find alpha cut of a plus b. Then we shall find alpha cut of a minus b and alpha cut of a multiply multiplied with b and alpha cut of a divided by b. So one by one we shall find now. So, uh, first we shall find alpha cut of a plus b. So, alpha cut of a plus b, by the definition, star definition, star operation definition, alpha cut of a plus b will be equal to alpha cut of a plus alpha cut of b. So, now what we have to do is, we have to first find alpha cut of a separately and then alpha cut of b separately for the given fuzzy numbers. And then we have to substitute them here. So, first we shall find alpha cut of A for the fuzzy number given here. So, alpha cut of A of X. So, first to find alpha cut of A. So, by the definition of alpha cut, we know that alpha cut of a fuzzy set will be equal to X such that whose membership grade is always greater than or equal to alpha. So, this is the definition of alpha cut set A. So, alpha cut of A. Now, by using this definition, we shall find the alpha cut sets for the given fuzzy number. So, now here we have three intervals given here. Now, to find, uh, find like for example, for A of X, First, we shall find the alpha cut set for where, uh, when the membership grade is 0. And then we shall find for this and this. But we know that alpha, by the definition of a fuzzy number, alpha belongs to open interval 0 and closed interval 1. So, this case will be eliminated because we know that 0 is not included in that interval. So, let us not deal for this. But for this case, here it is open at minus 1 and closed at 1. So, this interval will be considered. Similarly, for this it is open at 1 and this is closed at 3. So, we will be finding the alpha cut of A in between these two intervals. So, let us see that now. So, now first alpha cut of A, we have to find alpha cut of A to be equal to the first interval is what we will take this negative 1 1 so this is the first interval so it will be open interval minus 1 comma closed interval 1 such that all the membership grades in between this interval 
will be greater than or equal to alpha now what is the membership grade in that interval so this is the interval and the membership grade in that interval is x plus 1 the whole divided by 2 so we have to write here x plus 1 the whole divided by 2 is greater than or equal to alpha so now when we simplify this what do we get so alpha cut of a will be equal to minus 1 comma 1 such that so in this interval uh, what will happen to this this 2 uh, when it goes here it will become 2 alpha and this plus 1 we will take it to the right so it will be x greater than or equal to 2 alpha minus 1 so this is the alpha cut of a in between this interval similarly we shall find alpha cut of a in the interval 1 comma 3 so that will be we will write it here alpha cut of a is equal to in the interval open 1 closed 3 is such that what is the membership grade in that interval for 1 comma 3 it is 3 minus x by 2 so we have to write 3 minus x divided by 2 is greater than or equal to alpha so in a similar manner simplifying this we get it to be equal to open 1 closed 3 such that now this will be 3 minus x is greater than or equal to 2 alpha so after that when we take 3 to the other side we get minus x to be greater than or equal to 2 alpha minus 3 so it is minus x greater than or equal to 2 alpha minus 3 now further you can simplify this by changing the signs now when we change the sign this greater than or equal to will become lesser than or equal to so this will be equal to open interval 1 comma closed interval 3 such that now we, when we change the sign it will become plus x is lesser than or equal to negative 2 alpha plus 3 so the signs will be changed throughout and so finally we will have alpha cut of a in between this interval to be such that x lesser than or equal to 3 minus 2 alpha so now first in between this interval we have got x to be greater than or equal to 2 alpha minus 1 and here we have x to be lesser than or equal to 3 alpha minus 2 now we should combine these two and write alpha cut of a in general so alpha cut of a will be equal to now how the interval will be from minus 1 to 1 and 1 to 3 so generally we can write the interval as minus 1 comma 3 because we are combining both and we are writing such that now how you can write this this is this can be written as 2 alpha minus 1 is lesser than or equal to x because x is greater than this so x is greater than this and x is lesser than or equal to 3 minus 2 alpha so now uh, we have found alpha cut of a so it is the interval 2 alpha minus 1 comma 3 minus 2 alpha because the value of x lies between these two so it can be written as an interval and so therefore by using this we can write alpha cut of a to be equal to closed interval 2 alpha minus 1 comma 3 minus 2 alpha so because it is in between these two uh, points we can write it like this so after finding this interval we have to find an alpha cut of b in a similar manner like how we found alpha cut of a in the same way so now here we have to consider the um, fuzzy number b of x now in 0 we will not consider this case because alpha belongs to open 0 and closed 1 so this case is excluded now in between this interval 1 comma 3 we have to find the alpha cut of this uh, uh, that is here if you see 
uh, alpha cut of b is all those elements for which the membership grade is greater than or equal to alpha so first we consider the first interval given 1 comma 3 and that is given as x minus 1 divided by 2 so this is greater than or equal to alpha and when we simplify this we get it as x to be greater than or equal to 2 alpha minus 1 and the other interval given is 3 and 5 and in that interval the membership grade is 5 minus x divided by 2 and so that we will be finding here so 5 minus x divided by 2 is greater than greater than or equal to alpha in a similar way when we simplify this we get alpha cut of b to be equal to x lesser than or equal to 5 minus 2 alpha now what we have to do is we have to combine this and this and we have to write like how we wrote for uh, alpha cut of a so now alpha cut of b after combining it will be now here the interval is 1 comma 3 and here it is 5 uh, 3 comma 5 so it will be between 1 3 and 3 1 to 3 3 to 5 so it will be 1 to 5 and open at 1 and closed at 5 such that now here what did we get x to be greater than this so 2 alpha minus 1 is lesser than or equal to x and this x is lesser than this so lesser than or equal to 5 minus 2x and so therefore the interval that we obtain is alpha cut of b is equal to x lies between these two points so it becomes an interval and it's a closed interval because both are lesser than or equal to so 2 alpha minus 1 comma 5 minus 2 alpha so this is alpha cut of b so now we have found alpha cut of a and alpha cut of b so alpha cut of a is this so that is for alpha element of open 0 and closed 1 and the alpha cut of b is this for alpha element of open 0 and closed 1 now we have to find alpha cut of a plus b and so that will be equal to alpha cut of a plus alpha cut of b now we should take these two intervals that we have found recently and we have to substitute here alpha cut of a we have found it to be 2 alpha minus 1 comma 3 minus 2 alpha plus alpha cut of b is what 2 alpha minus 1 comma 5 minus 2 alpha now we have to add these two intervals and so that will be equal to we have to add this and this so it will be 2 alpha plus 2 alpha is 4 alpha minus 1 minus 1 will be minus 2 okay and then um, comma we have to add these two so 3 minus 2 alpha plus 5 minus 2 alpha so that will be we have minus 2 alpha minus 2 alpha which will give us minus 4 alpha and 3 plus 5 will give us 8 and so therefore the alpha cut of a plus b is equal to the interval 4 alpha minus 2 comma 8 minus 4 alpha uh, actually by mistake i have written negative 1 here it is actually plus 1 see uh, this is plus 1 reason is actually here we have uh, like here x is greater than or equal to 2 alpha plus 1 because here we have negative 1 when it goes to the other side it becomes plus 1 so x is greater than or equal to 2 alpha plus 1 so here here we have to make the correction and so because of that uh, here also we have to make the correction so here it is 2 alpha plus 1 and so the interval will be like here it will be 2 alpha plus 1 comma 5 minus 2 alpha and because of that we have 2 alpha plus 1 here kindly make this correction students okay so 2 alpha plus 1 and so because of that when we add these two it is 2 alpha minus 1 plus 2 alpha plus 1 so 2 alpha plus 2 alpha is 4 alpha minus 1 plus 1 will get cancelled and we will not have this term so it will become 0 here so therefore finally we have alpha cut of a plus b to be equal to 4 alpha comma 8 minus 4 alpha kindly make the correction that i have told you for and this is for alpha an element of open 0 and closed 1 so hope you have understood how to find alpha cut of a plus b in a similar way we have to find alpha cut of a minus b alpha cut of a multiplied by b and alpha cut of a divided by b which we will see in our future videos thank you